Hello, friends. Let's see if this is broadcasting correctly. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we are. Okay. All right. <clears throat> welcome, welcome. If you are just joining me and wondering what in the heck is going on, um, I am sharing a couple of tips with you guys today <clears throat> about, I was just downloading um, a picture of, um, let me put this other one down. My dog wants to come sit next to me, so he's about to jump on something. All right, so... <clears throat> I was scrolling through Facebook. One of the things that we do with send out cards, and I say we, I shouldn't say we, that's like me, myself, and I, right? Um, okay, so first of all, um, my name is April, and this is my Facebook page. It is called Simple Classic Life. So if you want to visit us there, you're welcome to. However, that's not what this is about today. So today, um, I want to give you a couple of tips about send out cards, all right? <clears throat> I was going over to a friend of mine's page. <clears throat> if you need an introduction to send out cards, um, you can go over to um, our YouTube channel. I can link to it later on this uh, if you like, but um, anyway. All right, so back to my original reason for going live. When we, when I go to somebody's page to download a picture. All right, so here I was. I was here. Um, I was on my Facebook page, and I saw this picture, which is the cutest thing ever. This is my friend Donna McCain, and um, I wanted to download this picture and send it to her because it's just the cutest thing ever, right? So look what happens when you go, if you click on the picture and you go down here to options, right here to options is where you normally would go download a picture, right? So you click on options and look, it's not there. It says enter full screen, give feedback, report photo, or embed. So you're, now you're going, oh gosh, how am I going to download this photo? Okay, so let me show you what to do. It came from her daughter, all right? So I'm going to go to her daughter's page then and see that she made it her cover photo, but when they make it a cover photo, it's no longer downloadable. So look down here is where she originally uploaded the photo. So you click on that, and now you click options, and there's the download option okay so i'm telling you a little tricky trick way to get around because in reality that picture was not casey's or donna's to begin with it was this person okay and it looks like <coughs> she's the one maybe even that took the picture so now i have that picture because i downloaded it and now i'm going to show you another little trick the, sometimes the pictures that you download from people's Facebook pages are um, too dark or they are something, okay? So, for instance, the picture that I just downloaded from her. You can upload a picture to Google Photos, all right? So, let's do that. <clears throat> We'll upload this picture to Google Photos, and I want to show you a really, really quick way to adjust a photo, okay? So you click on the photo that you just uploaded right here, all right? Now look over here. See these little three buttons? It almost looks like a musical score, <laughs> sort of. I'm not much of a musician, but <coughs> excuse me, y'all. Um, so you click Edit. And look at this. All right, now I'm going to click on auto, but you watch the picture instead of watching me click auto. Watch the picture. I'm going to click on auto. Okay? So see how it just made their faces pop out a little more? But then there are 
at least a dozen different filters that you can put on these pictures if you want to in Google Photos. And they're all amazing in my opinion. And so you could just go through there and do that, okay? Now her picture was fine, I think the way it downloaded, so I'm just gonna leave it like that. But I just wanna show you that you can do that from Google Photos. Then once you're done with it, you click on the menu up here and click download. And then you can go over to send out cards. Okay, so that picture is just the cutest thing ever. So I, <clears throat> I know that I have sent Donna McCain some cards before. So what I wanna do first is click on relationships. My friend Melissa is Marco Poloing me from Kosovo. Um, click on relationships and click on the person and see over here it says history and edit. So I'm going to click on history because I really want to see what I've sent to her recently. All right, so just October the 12th, I sent her something. And it was this card. of her new granddaughter, okay? And that was the back of the card. All right, so there's that, and then I sent her a birthday card back in June, and that's it. So um, back, in no, back in October, so it's been over a month ago, I sent her a card congratulating her on her um, new grandbaby. And so now that we've got this card, um, and I'm just going to, instead of, we don't want to say celebrating you, because this is just a wonderful picture of their family. Let's see. Um, my favorite moment. Oh, that would be a good one. I just love all these cards, y'all. It just, I literally sometimes will sit here while I'm watching a movie and, um, Send cards to people. Oh, here's a good one. All right, this is it. So I'm going to send this one to her. A flat card. Next. I'm going to click on picture. I'm going to click upload a photo. And it's right here under downloads. And I do go through periodically and clean out my download folder. And I'm going to move it up a little bit. And on the back, I'm just going to type her a quick little note. Okay, there we go. And then I'll select all and pick a nice font and make it bigger and hit next. Add recipients. Click on Donna. There's all my Donnas. I should have hit McCain instead. Let's see. There we go. And hit go. There we go. All right, ready to send. And see how the dollar seventy-five gets marked out. And it says free. And there you go. Congratulations, you just made the world a better place. So never once have I had somebody say, Ugh, would you stop sending me cards? And I don't flood people with them at all. Um, I just send them as I see them. So you just go through your Facebook page and if you're a business owner, that's the other cool thing about this, if you're a business owner, people are posting their absolute favorite pictures on Facebook. So you get something like this, this is this guy's whole family. Don't you know that he would love to get this picture in a card so that he could put it up in his office somewhere? Um, it costs, oh there we are, 
It costs nearly nothing to do this. Um, several of my friends are using this service and because I get a referral fee for them using it from the company, um, I pay about 40 bucks a month now and um, I send unlimited cards. So this is so much fun, y'all. It has nothing to do with making money at all. There are people that use this as a ridiculously big income, but I don't. Um, I just love sending cards to people. So anyway, there you have it. And um, I'm fixing to go in here. Here's my Google photos. I'm fixing to go in here. This was us trying to take a family, <laughs> take a family picture today. Oh, mercy. We'll get it. This, my poor dog was like, what, where do I stand? What do I do? And this was me testing it, trying to figure out how far away to get. Um, anyway, oh, this is a card my friend sent me the other day. Um, from my Kosovo trip. Oh my gosh. How cool is that? This is another one of my friends that uses send out cards and she sent me this card full of pictures from my Kosovo trip and I put it up in my, um, put it up in my thing. Oh, this is a friend of mine. Um, look right here. Brownies for the win. Close an $18,000 deal. Client said he chose us because of the brownies. I've won a listing because I sent brownies. Seven bucks on brownies, eleven thousand dollars commission. Lots and lots of real estate agents use send out cards and use the brownies from send out cards to send to people, and it just makes you memorable. That's all there is to it. So, anyway, if you're interested in uh, using this, and the service is free, the cards are two seventy five a piece plus a stamp. So anyway, it's so fun, y'all. I hope this helps. I hope this little picture tip helped you today figure out how to download pictures off Facebook and send them to people and then maneuver them in Google Photos. And um, that's it. I hope y'all have a wonderful, wonderful day. God bless and go make somebody smile today. Love y'all.